Hear ye, hear ye the bells. Which means, do you hear the bells? You, you don't, that was the bells. I was playing them on the, never mind. Intro. Well, rest of the intro. The bells was actually part of the intro. It's beginning to look a lot like Christmas. Everywhere you go. Take a look at the five and ten, glistening once again, with candy canes and silver lanes aglow. It's beginning to look a lot like Christmas, oh yes, and we're gonna learn how to play this song, because it's quite a delightful song, and it's a very nice to play, that's why we're gonna learn it together today. Sorry about that. Sorry, I should have just said, hi, I'm Ben. So we're going to learn it's beginning to look a lot like Christmas. And it is uh, beginning to look a lot like Christmas, namely because moose and, I mean, that's, that's a lot already, isn't it? Yes, the Perry Como song of 1951, it's quite a while ago, gets the ukulele treatment here thanks to the patrons supporting these lessons. So thanks to you wonderful people and people watching for free. You can actually thank them too in the comments if you want. Um, we're going to have a look at the intro first that you don't really need to play because not many people know it. It's from the original song in 1951, but actually it's really nice to play the bells. And that's something you can use in any song that you're going to play in G. These are the bells in G. The bells of G, something in G, Kilford. Um, the way to play this is 4755. What does that mean? Well, that's a very good question. I'm glad you're being very astute. It means index on the four, little finger on the seven next to it. Ta-da! And then we've got five five with, with fingers three and four, or middle and ring finger. And that's your bells. Bum, bum, bum. It's so nice to open with bells. And you just play thumb, index, third, fourth, middle finger, ring finger. So each string once downward with four, seven, five, five. And you've got your bells. You can play this two or somewhere, you know, between 10 and 20 if you really want to get the mood going. And then we've got the little intro with a bit of strumming quite fast um, with um, C, B minor, A minor, G, E minor, A7, A7, 9, where we have an A7 add the ring finger and go back to A7 and then D, A7, D. So the chords go like this. A7, D. It can be a bit tricky to have this transition here. I'll do it slowly with the strumming to give you an idea. Three. Four. A minor. Change. A7. A7 9. A7. And then three downs at the end. D. A7 and D. Two, 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 five with our little finger at the top there. And then after that we're ready, oops, to start the song. We start singing on this note if you want to make sure we've got it on the E. It's beginning to look a lot like Christmas. It's beginning. It's... Let's just do the chords for now. It's be G. beginning to look a C lot like Christmas. Return to the G after the C. And here we have A to C to. What does that mean? That means string of A, second fret, and then string of C, second fret. And that's the echo from the voice. It's really nice to do because then you have a bit of orchestration, not only chords with your ukulele, but a bit of the orchestra coming through also. It's beginning to look a lot like Christmas. Bum. Every... And actually you can do not necessarily just the two notes, but a G down, for, for example, with your thumb and hitting that A2 last and then playing the C2. That's how I prefer to do it. It's beginning to look a lot like G Christmas. So you see I'm going faster. You should try it. I'll watch. Okay, you can do it later. A, B7, everywhere on where? And on C a go, go E7. Take a look in the five and ten. I always get this wrong, but it's 
Take a look in the five and ten And then G Glistening once again On once again we've got frets Two, three, four on the C string to help you sing Glistening once again And then G sharp diminished That means one, two, one, two With candy canes and silver lanes aglow And where we sing with The word with Is exactly where we sang the word again. So if I hold it, glistening once again with candy canes and silver lanes aglow. But of course, you're not supposed to sing through, it's supposed to sound like this glistening once again with candy canes and silver lanes aglow. And here we have D, C minor, D, C minor 6, D, which means D, 2, 3. 3-3 three, three, with your middle finger here on all the threes and then 2-2-2-0 two, 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 oh, back on the D except we have down, down, up, down, up and we change on the down here and then C minor 6 on the second down down, up, down and then another D here down so it goes down, down, up, down, ah, uh, down <laughs> down, down, up, down, up again down, down, up, down, up and faster that will be down, down, up, down, up. So all you do is you leave your index here for the D. It doesn't matter if the A string doesn't ring for that D. And just put your middle finger for the C minor 6 and then take it away. So you have this fast change. Otherwise, if you do everything with fingers, it might be a bit, a lot of, a lot of commotion. With that in mind, let's have a look at the second verse, which is basically the same-ish. It's beginning to look, it's beginning to... It's beginning to look a sea lot like G Christmas G. Toys in every store C and E7, but the prettiest sight to see. That's very pretty, isn't it? It's worth making those that extra step and learning those diminished chords so that you really have those colors from the original. But the prettiest sight to see, and that's really easy. It's open one, open one for the G diminished which is not the same as the G sharp diminished, which we had just before. Is the G holly that will E7 be on your A minor on D7 front door G, D, G. And at the end here, we just go down, 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 G, G, G. A pair of hop along boots and, and that we'll have a look at that just after the rhythm, because we need a rhythm to send us hopping through, if I understand the song correctly, the Christmas shops with lots of ribbons and gifts and something called the 5 and 10 which may or may not be a clock. Comments. So what you want to have for this song is a light Christmas skip. It's snowing but not too much and it's very pleasant and so we're walking around like this but with a skip which means that it's not straight like walking. <laughs> we're actually skipping. But you don't always have to skip back up. You don't always have to play the skip back up. Of course you always skip back up. But you don't always have to make it sound against the strings. Sometimes you can just play It's beginning to look a lot like Christmas That's fine. Everywhere you go And use it sometimes and sometimes not. So we have either down or down, up, down, up, down. But it's always the same movement anyway. It doesn't matter if you're playing the up or not. It's the same movement in sort of your relaxed shoulder and in the forearm. Uh, quite a relaxed wrist, but not too much. Sort of everywhere in the middle, basically. Nice balance and everything. It's beginning to look a lot like Christmas. Everywhere I go. That's a bit too bluesy, that. Sorry. Take a look in the five and ten. Glistening once again with candy canes and silver lanes aglow. Down, up, down, up, down, down, bad, about. Basically, as I, I mean, I meant, I meant, I meant. It's beginning to look a lot like Christmas. The echo toys in every store. E7, but the prettiest sight to G diminished is the holly that will E7 on your A minor. D7 front door, D, G, and at the end, down, down, down. And then we move on to uh, the inside of the shop. Right now we're walking outdoors and now we're in. So starting on the G, not too fast. A pair of hop along boots and a pistol that shoots is the wish of Barney and Jen. 
Dolls that will talk and will go for a walk is the hope of Janice and Ben. So you've noticed two things. First of all, I changed the lyrics very, very slightly. And also the other thing is that I'm slightly lifting my fingers um, so that the chords don't necessarily ring too long, like this. And I'm going, boop, I'm lifting my fingers a bit. But you don't need to do that. And on the last line, and mom and dad, it's quite interesting because I've written all the frets that you can play as you sing, and then you've got a bit of an orchestration going with the, the bassoon or the clarinet or whatever, going up, and you going down with the voice. You're going down with the voice, and mom and dad can, quite close at the beginning, mom and dad can hardly, that's semitones, and you wait here with the C2, and mom, C2, mom and dad, then you start playing C4, E2, E3, E5, and mom and dad can hardly wait for school to start again. So just the ukulele will be like this. C2, C4, E2, E3, E5, A2, A3, E4, E5, and just the singing. And mum and dad can hardly wait for school to start again all together. And mum and dad can hardly wait for school to start again. It's beginning to look a lot like Christmas, isn't it? Especially if you play that line that way. I'll just play the two other verses for you so that you've heard it all. It's beginning to look a lot like Christmas Everywhere you go There's a tree in the Grand Hotel One in the park as well The sturdy kind that doesn't mind the snow Here's different A minor D at the end. We stop on the D and then It's beginning to look a lot like Christmas Soon the bells will start and the thing that will make them ring is the carol that you sing. Favorite bit. Right within your heart. Ooh. That's my favorite bit because the carol F7 that you E7 sing. And stop. Right within. That's not easy to find the notes here, but it's third fret of the C string, fourth fret of the C string, and then a C up here. Right within. Right within. D7. Your heart. And then you've got the whole song. After that, you can uh, do an instrumental verse if you like, sing the bit about Ben and Janice again, and then sing this particular last verse again, and you've got the whole original song from Perry. In the document that goes with this, this lesson, the bells, for example, and the, the bit with the tee, 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 they're not only written with numbers, they're also written with tabs for those who prefer to have that with lines and numbers rather than just letters and numbers. And you can get that song sheet and support these lessons in the description. Enjoy the Christmas feel as it arrives slowly. Bye-bye, see you soon.